Well, ladies and gentlemen, as the new undisputed champion, Cody Rhodes, stands in the ring. Seems like he has got something to say about the different looking title. Oh my god, it's Finn Balor. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Balor with some words for Cody and a warning for tonight. Especially going into the main event, so I wonder what that means. Well then, ladies and gentlemen, it seems we will be figuring out what Finn Balor means by... Oh, he's got something planned for the main event, and it will go perfectly. What the? Oh my god, it's Damien Priest! Oh, but, oh, Cody! Oh shit! Crossroads! Oh. Oh. And Cody Rhodes just showing that he is ready for anything. Oh, wait. Wait, ladies and gentlemen. Crossroads! Oh my god, again! And oh my god, on the chair! Oh. The picking priest up and throwing him outside. And just saying, see you in the main event, Damien. Well, ladies and gentlemen, a, a, a desperate Tommaso Ciampa is here for one thing and one thing only, and that is the Rebirth Television Championship. And as we saw last series, Tommaso Ciampa broke away from the Judgment Day. And now, he's back. He doesn't want anyone's help. And according to Gargano, he'll need his help. And he'll know when. But right now, I don't think he'll need anybody's help. Because Tommaso Ciampa 
is about to take on Dominic Mysterio for the Rebirth Television Championship. Because remember, folks, Dominic lost at WrestleMania against his father, which meant he loses the Guerrero name and he loses the mask. And it seems Dominic bears a new mask around his face, around his disrespectful, disgraceful face. So, will Dominic be able to keep his championship against a seasoned vet, a former United Nations, United States, and undisputed champion in Tommaso Ciampa? Or, or will Dom's reign be ending here tonight? We will see in our first matchup of 2K24 Reaver. Television Championship. Introducing the challenger from Melbourne, Wisconsin, weighing in at 201 pounds, Tommaso Ciampa. And his opponent from San Diego, California, weighing in at 200 pounds. The television champion, Dirty Dominic Mysterio. And as we heard in the crowd's reaction, the crowd still hates Dom. The referee for this match is Charles Robinson. With that said, ladies and gentlemen. Champa looks ready to win more gold. And Dominic. Oh, discus. Oh, oh but Champa blocking it off. Oh, 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 shit. Oh, oh, my turnover. Oh, knee to the face. Then, they walk. One. Oh, kick out. Oh, man. Oh, Dom. Oh shit, Dom! Roll out of the way. Springboard. Turn out of DDT. Now Dom going outside. Dominic on the outside now. He's telling. He's telling Champa to shh. Oh. Tommaso Ciampa flying out on Dom. Oh, Dom took it out. Not paying attention. Oh, it's in the steps. Of the, of the ring. Of the black heart. Oh. oh, no. Oh, no. This is not good. Oh, Dominic. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Ciampa. Oh, put me. Oh, shit. Ciampa. Champa, what are you doing to Dom? What are you doing? Remember, count of 20, ladies and gentlemen. These two have all the time in the world. Oh my god, I'm a champ! Well, I guess Tommaso Champa is second on child abuse with Rey Mysterio. As he taunts. Oh, oh, right. Oh, running neck breaker to Tommaso Ciampa. Oh, Dom taking advantage. 14, six more seconds, remember. 
TV cha or championships cannot change via countout. In the ring. Oh, Dom. Oh, blocked. Oh, Champa. Shit, dodging it, blocking it, throwing him into the corner. Oh, right knee. Oh, Champa. Oh, oh, dropped it. Oh, shit. Champa. Project. Champa. One. Oh, kick out. Champa saying it's done. Going outside. Tommaso Champa looking to do something. Something to Dominic. I don't know what. Turns around. Oh! What the? It, it's Finn Balor. Oh shit. 1916 and the bell is ringing. Oh my god. And as we see here, Dominic is in the corner. Finn sends in Tommaso. One Finn coming in. It's Tone Champa. Nah, nah. You can't do this. Oh, man, coup de gras. Leg sweep. De gras. Finn. Send him in. Over. Wait. Johnny Gargano. Oh, Jacob. Drop Jacob. Johnny runs in the ring. Oh, shot to the face of Balor. Shot by Balor. Shot by Johnny. Trevor Balor! Oh! Balor! Oh, getting reversed by Johnny! Johnny. There's Johnny. Turns behind him. Looks at Tommaso. Tags him in! Oh, it's been! Oh!
Well, ladies and gentlemen, we all saw it here, and we saw the shows that will be happening throughout the series. And man, oh man. Man, oh man, what a number of shows, what a host of shows for the series. But, we also saw some, some happenings with the Bloodline. And Roman on his quest to find his cousin Jay. He still doesn't know where he is, especially after Jay left, after WrestleMania. So will Roman find Jay? We can only wait and see. Besides that, ladies and gentlemen, besides all the best backstage happenings, we have our next contest and a chance for Liv Morgan to really prove herself against, that's right, the Women's World Champion, the WWE Women's World Champion, and the Rebirth, the Undisputed Rebirth Women's Champion, Rhea Ripley, will mommy stay on top or will she be embarrassed in her first showing after defeating the man at wrestlemania we will have to wait and see can live do it or will Rhea stand tall here we go second match of the series oh my god out of the air <laughs> live goes oh shit Oh shit, four Nelson bomb. Pinfall. One, Charles off. One count. Got it. Oh, roundhouse kick to Lib Morgan. Lib Morgan feeling all that. Lib Morgan, of course, a former SmackDown Women's Champion. Uh, former Raw Women's Champion, I believe. And ever since she stepped foot in River, she has been wanting to become undisputed women's champion. She believes she is one of the absolute best. And until she becomes the undisputed women's champion, she will not be the best. And Charles down for the cover, but only a one count. And Rhea Ripley, on the other hand, has been holding on to that championship for a year. A year, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Liv switches it out. Sends Rhea out. But Rhea catches her. Oh, Rhea. Oh, axe handle. And goddamn, ladies and gentlemen. Rhea Ripley said she's, she's on the hunt to become the longest reigning undisputed woman's champion. Oh, my God. Of history. Oh, my God. Liv pulls down the ropes. And then out she goes. Liv Morgan feeling it, just telling Raya, oh, you better get off your high horse, because I'm coming, I'm coming, oh my god, shots, oh, my, oh, Raya getting out of it with a gut kick, now back into the ring, back into the ring, mommy, uh, goes the other way, oh, and Cigar, no one there, of course, we would push off, oh, but Liv is still in it, oh, shit, oh, 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 fuck. Hand playing with Ray Ripley. Oh, shit. Oh, 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 oh fuck. Into Charles Robinson. Off the ropes. Oh, over. Oh, oh, pop up drop. Remember, no rope breaks, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, kick out. No rope breaks. You don't need no bullshit here in the series. Got a tit stomp by Rhea Ripley, but Liv using that energy, using each stomp to revitalize her tactics, her body. Oh shit! Oh my god! A shining wizard. 
Oh, Ray, that is nice. And, oh, nice and out. Oh, shit. Live on a comeback. Oh. Oh, it's a guy by Ray Ripley. Oh, Liv trying to get out, but Ray Ripley not letting her. Oh, shot to the face. Oh, fuck. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> the ropes. Reverse electric chair. Ray going for the pin. One. Two. Oh, kick out. Oh, my God. Oh, stomping on the arm. Oh, my God, Ray, just stomping on the hand. Hand and arm. Oh, Ray. Oh, shit. Throw and live. Fine, fine. You wanna disrespect me? I'll break you. Live thrown outside. Oh, oh my god. No, 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 no. Reptile on the outside. And Raya, cocky as ever. Into the ring. Will that be it for Liv? Or did Rhea spend too much time outside? One, two. Oh, too much time outside. Too much time outside spent by the Reaper, Rhea Ripley. Into the corner. Oh, knee to the face. Oh, Liv. Liv. Oh, Liv. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, oh, sends her off. Oh, gets out of the way. Oh, shit. Oh, no way there for the drop kick. Oh, fuck. Oh, 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 shit. Oh, my God. Look at Liv Morgan go. Sends her off. Oh, fuck. down. Oh my god. Ray is just bouncing right back up. Oh shit. Raya trying to get back to it. Oh. Oh shit. Alabama slam. Oh my god. Reverse Alabama slam. Oh coming at them cheeks. Oh shit. Face buster. <laughs> God damn. Rhea. Not giving up. Not giving up. All picking up and throwing Liv Morgan. Oh. Liv rolling out. Smart thing to do. Oh my god. Oh no. Force build put upon Liv by herself. Oh shit! Ow! Oh. Able to redeem herself. I think she casted stupefied before she hit the ground all right to the post. God damn. Liv taking it all. Taking it all in. Oh shit. Rhea gets her. Oh, off the apron. Oh, sends her off. Goes back in. Liv Morgan getting up. Oh, shit. Rhea has her. Oh, into the ring now. Going in. Oh shit! Oh, oh shaka drop kick. Oh shit! Oh, oh, 
Oh, Liv again just pushing the neck back of Rhea Ripley. Oh shit! No oblivion! Oh, Liv, trying to fight back, but nothing takes you away from the Riptide! One, two, three! And Rhea Ripley stands tall! Tiffany Stratton definitely trying to boil the champion over. I think Rhea can contain that rage until they meet, or if they meet. And that's a huge if, because Tiffany Stratton will have to win the Queen of Hearts tournament to be Rhea Ripley's opponent at Castle Clash. Because that's going to be our first show, ladies and gentlemen. And going off the, what we saw earlier. That will be happening in June. Now. Question is, is will Tiffany be able to do it? Or will she not? We will be seeing. But until then, I think it's time we move to the Well, ladies and gentlemen, the bloodline said they'll have some stuff to say next week. Wonder what that will entail? I'm pretty sure all their plans. And then, we also heard some words from Seth freaking Rollins. And as you saw, he is unsure of what he's gonna do. Unsure he is what he will do this series. 
after coming off a string of losses after that one victory against the Velveteen Dream. But maybe, maybe Seth Rollins will be asking for a spot in the in the um, National Cup or something to rev them up. We will be seeing. But until then, we move on to our next matchup. Our first matchup of the King of Hearts Tournament. <clears throat> the first one to determine who will get the first undisputed championship match <laughs> of the season. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Old Prophet Montez Ford has now changed the name of nothing but Prophet to Money Incorporated. And Montez told me, you know, on the fly down here, that he will be champ this year. Doesn't matter what champion, but he will be. He wants to become undisputed champion, but he doesn't mind taking other titles along the way. So can Old Prophet Montez Ford win here tonight against Nathan Frazier, a very fiery young talent. Or Nathan Frazier break through Montez. We will be safe in our first King of Hearts matchup. There we go. And a referee of the match, Charles Robinson. Our, uh, our reps that we hired um, in the opening months will be showcased though. Well, oh, I need to go back. But right now, we already got Charles. And Charles is a, Charles is a real good boy. He'll do his job. And, you know, we haven't finished creating the ref outfits for us. Oh, my God. So, uh, Charles is wearing his WWE outfit. Montez, throwing Frazier back in. And we lift him up again. A shot. Oh! 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 Off of the, off of the turn mark again. Going for the pin. Will this be it for Frazier? No! Take it out. When Frazier kicks out. Montez with a, just a shocked, shocked face off that. I mean, you know, you shouldn't really, you should not overlook your opponent. And Montez Ford thinks he is better than each of his opponent, and right now he is. He is. He is feeling way overconfident, telling his opponent to suck it, but can he make this suicide dive? Oh! Oh, oh yes, he can. Oh, and Ford just, man, tonned it up against Frazier. Oh, stupid it to the crowd. Oh, I'm gonna suck it. Oh, but Frazier almost caught him. Oh, but Ford did. Great, great awareness from Ford. Oh, but Frazier gets a knee to the gut. Oh, into the step. Oh. <laughs> Serves you right, in my opinion. Should never be that overly cocky during a match. Ford, back up, going up. Ah, oh, spear off by Frazier. Nathan Frazier. Oh shit! Oh my god! Sent on over the rope. Count of eight. Now we have a count of twenty, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, Frazier coming back in, but Ford no oh, fuck catches him with a spring more drop body pinball. One, oh, take it out. Goddamn Frazier having some resiliency here tonight. Take it out of that springboard. Crossbody. Uh, and Ford employing the strikes. Oh, super kick to the gut. Oh, it's a great. Oh, 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 oh. Frazier dodges that. Yeah, great. Oh, no. Oh, God. Right to the upper right shoulder. Upper right shoulder, no shit. The shoulder. Ah, oh, kick out by Ford. Oh, oh no, we're there for the shooting star press. Ford going up. But Frazier's right there. Oh, kick to the, kick to the shoulder. Oh, drop kick. Oh, 
Charles Robinson is knocked out. Wait. Oh my god, right to the face of Nathan Frazier. Oh, Robinson getting up. Oh, kick out. Oh, Ford. Oh, Robinson. Take it out of the way. Oh, oh, oh Frazier gets into the music area. Oh, this is. Oh, where's that leg? Chips Frazier catches Ford, sends him into the corner. Oh, block the shot. Oh. Ford now sending Frazier into the corner. Oh, whoa. Whoa. What do we got planned here, ladies and gentlemen? Oh, super flex. Oh, oh, oh. Into the middle. But Ford, going up. Oh, elbow. Ford lifted him up. Oh, oh shit. Oh, oh, Ford. Oh, 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 Frazier. This is taunting. Oh, 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 stay back in. Oh, God. Oh, Frazier taunting. Not a wise thing to do. Frazier, I'm going after Ford. Oh, oh, elbow in the face. Oh, the, oh, Ford right, just kicks up. Oh, right to the back of the head. Oh, Ford. Oh, profit, drop power. One, two. Oh, 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 yeah, oh my god. <laughs> oh, oh, Frazier, oh! STO into the middle of the turn, Marco. Oh, kick to the face. Oh, oh, dodged it. Oh, axe handle to the shoulder. Oh, oh, drop it. Ford, puts him up. Oh, uppercut. Oh, Frazier. Oh, shit. Where are we going? We're going off. And off the ropes and... Oh, cool. Oh, I catch him off guard. Oh, the Frazier dumbfounded. Montez Ford! Blockbuster! Which goes in two. The Frog Splash! Profit Splash! Three! And Montez Ford wins it here for himself to move forward in the Kings of Courts tournament. And Ford is feeling hyped, trying to use it. Trying to use underhanded tactics in the beginning of the match did not work. So what did Ford do? He just pulled through and, you know, won it the only way he knew how to win it. And that's just by winning. Pushing through and winning. But the question is, is as he gets deeper into the tournament, as the opponents possibly get tougher, what will Ford do to move forward? We will be seen. But until then, I think it's time we move to the back. Well, some words from Cody and Priest in the back before the match. And Finn Balor was, you know, Finn Balor said earlier, well, maybe your reign won't be so long, Cody. 
maybe. But your judgment is here. Making his way to the representing the judgment day. From New York City, weighing in at 249 pounds, And I mean, that's, that is a possibility, ladies and gentlemen, because Finn Balor is Mr. Money in the Bank. And we could possibly see the end of Cody's reign here tonight in the first episode of 2K24 Reaver. But that's, that's a it. I'm pretty sure Cody is going to be wanting to hold on to that championship for as long as he can. Prove that he is worthy. Prove that he can take on anybody. And his win against Walter at WrestleMania wasn't that. Wasn't just luck. So, what will Cody have to pull out? What will Cody have to look out for here tonight in the main event? We will be seeing champion Cody Rhodes and Cody Rhodes told us earlier with a new champ after a length like that a dominant reign from Walter a thousand fifty seven days as champion he wanted to introduce a new title and man that new title is beautiful we see it on the waist of the American Nightmare. And Damian Priest looks at it from outside the ring. And I bet one day Damian wants to become Undisputed Champion. So maybe tonight he can prove himself. Oh, my. oh God, no, no lockup. Only knees to the gut of the American Nightmare. Oh, oh shit. Oh, oh take that. Oh, shit. Oh, pain tickler. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Cody just... Oh! Saturday it up. Oh. Oh, with the kick. Oh, boy. Damien. He's blown for a loop. Blown Damien. And... Oh, but Damien tossing it up. Oh, no way there. Oh. Oh, disaster kick. Beautiful. Beautiful by Cody Rhodes. Pinball. One. Two. Oh, kick out. Damien Priest kicking out for Cody. Still there. Damien getting the lockup. Dragging Cody Rhodes to the corner. But Cody Rhodes getting out of it. Oh! Getting out of it. Sending him off the ropes. Oh! Caught him. Uppercut. God damn. Oh, to the top. Damien. Damien not really getting a chance to shine here. Oh, God. Rhodes going on the apron now. I'm going around. Oh, Damien coming in. Oh, shot to the face by Cody. Oh, but oh, Damien spared the wall. Cody dumbfounded. Priest taunting. Oh, oh, fuck him up. God damn. Oh, Cody! Oh, no, to the back of Damien Priest. Pinball. 
Remember, no rope breaks, ladies and gentlemen. Here in Rebirth, take out. Oh, 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 poor son put up. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, fuck. Oh, arm strapped and lariat. God damn, that could potentially pull your shoulder out of socket, ladies and gentlemen. It's like by the way you're twisted and the way your arm is trapped. Now, Damien Priest has the advantage. Put the foot in the face of the American Nightmare. Where he's going up. What is this gonna be? Awesome! Oh, <laughs> Onto the very damaged torso of Cody Rhodes. I mean, God damn, he went. He went such a. He went 20 minutes with Walter, ladies and gentlemen. And all those chops and stuff don't. Like, I mean, they go away, but you still feel them. Oh my God! Pop up. Punch by Damian Priest. Oh, oh, DDT by Priest. With Cody bringing Priest on the stage. Oh, blocked it. Oh, 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 Priest blocking it. Oh, shit. Oh, my God, backbreaker. But Damian Priest has the advantage now. Oh, 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 Dominator on the stage, on the metal break, god damn. Count of eight, 12 more seconds, throws him in. God damn, oh, Cody still dumbfounded, Cody struggling to get up. Not able to get up, oh, go in there. Oh, 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 Trenton for the cross of the Taking it, Priest blocks it off. Oh, over. Oh, under. Oh, oh, come in. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, Cody. Pedigree. Oh. <laughs> one. Oh, God. Whoa. Oh, oh, kicking out at one on the pedigree. Holy shit. Oh, Cody. Oh, close the light on that. with his Cody on planned hair. Nothing. Oh, wait. No. Cast the stupefy. Oh, Moosa! Oh. <laughs> Almost cost him there. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh. Oh, into the ring. I was going into the steps. Damien Priest able to rekindle himself right there. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Catches Damien off guard. Oh, another Russo. Oh, and into a crossroads. One bit. One, two. Oh no, kick out. God damn, Damien Priest kicking out of the crossroads. And it makes you ask, will Cody have to implement the triple crossroads? The one thing he used to defeat Walter. We will be seeing, oh my god, going everywhere for Damian Priest. Oh, shoulder tackle. Oh, oh, Priest. Oh, springboard forearm. Catches Cody. And I think Cody might because Damian doesn't look to me. Slowing down. Jumping up her cut. Oh. Hard shot to the face. Oh. oh shit. Oh. Oh my god! Back super dumping Cody on his neck. And Cody looks to be out, ladies and gentlemen. Now, Priest. Going to bring a pawn. Oh, nothing. Oh, disaster kick again. Oh, shit.
Cody. Oh, 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 no pedigree priest. Oh, 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 gets out of it. Damien Priest getting out of that pedigree. Oh, Cody. Oh, oh, kick to the gut. An uppercut. Oh, oh Priest. Oh, 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 bringing him in for a close line. Oh, oh, big boom. Eat the defeat, Cody. Oh my god. Vicious big boots from the from the archer of infamy. Oh, Cody feeling all that. Especially only a couple days removed from his match with Walter. Oh. Finishes off his opponent because he finishes off his opponent with one crossroads, two crossroads, three crossroads, one, two, three, and Cody Rhodes stands tall. Cody Rhodes employing a new show of dominance here in the series with that win against Damian Grace. Now the question comes out, what is next? What the hell is... Oh, God, trash can throw right in the face of Cody Rhodes. Oh, my God, it's Finn Balor. The ref is informing me that... Finn Balor has cashed in his Money in the Bank briefcase. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh! Oh! Super flex on the trash can. Oh my god. Cody does not know where he is at, ladies and gentlemen. Perfectly fine. Oh, oh my god. No, 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 no. Oh my god. Oh, throwing it. And Finn just telling Cody, this is what's gonna come. This is what was gonna come for you. you the moment you won the other team championship. Finn. Oh, one more time with the 1916. That's not how he finishes opponents. He wins it with the two to draw. Jumps. Oh, it's it's Randy Orton. Oh my God, the Viper is back, and he saves Cody Rhodes, throwing Balor out. Cody Rhodes in the corner, just staring at Randy, saying thank you. Randy, Randy just saying, no problem, Cody, no problem. Look at the level of respect from Randy. 
puts it down right in front of Cody. And Cody. Like, yeah, man. Yeah. And Cody. Just telling the telling the camera, but also Judgment Day. You will not get a victory that easily over me. So, as the American Nightmare stands tall. Oh my god! Randy Orton. Showing his true colors. Here tonight on Rebirth. Oh my god, again. But Randy showing his true colors here tonight. And I mean, god damn, that was an unexpected return. But it looks like family, it looks like close friends, doesn't matter to Randy. This point in his career. Will Cody Rhodes be successful in his first defense? Or will the Viper strike and take it away from him? Or will a third party take control and cash in on the opportunity? We will have to wait and see. But until then, this has been the first episode of 2K24 Rebirth.